Is there anything more festive than a Christmas market? Join me in wonderful, wonderful Copenhagen. This is very exciting. As we explore some of the most magical markets in the world. Wow. And discover the Danish traditions. Look at that beauty. That make this place so special. This is the most gloriously unusual Christmas dinner I have ever had. One of the happiest countries on earth. What do you reckon? Merry Christmas. <laughs> At one of the happiest times of year. Glue. Glue. I mean, look at that out there. That looks like fun. It looks like Christmas. Welcome to Copenhagen. <laughs> We all love a Christmas market. And here in Copenhagen, they have some of the very best. This laid back city has always been a favourite for British tourists. And at this festive time of year, it's easy to see why. There are lots of Christmas markets in this city, but there is one Christmas destination that's far bigger and more famous than any other. Tivoli. You coming? Started in 1843, Tivoli is one of the oldest amusement parks in the world. And at this time of year, 1,000 Christmas trees and 1 million lights transform it into the ultimate Christmas playground. Oh, I think I might lose my hat. And my breakfast at this rate. You just put it there and just clear. I'm rubbish. The windmill's got a Santa Claus hat. Local tour guide Crystal Herring has offered to show me some more of the Tivoli magic. This is lovely. This is famous all around the world, isn't it? Yes, and have you been in Disneyland? Yeah. Do you know where Disney got the idea? He came to visit Tivoli and he got inspired from Tivoli. You can certainly see why. There is childlike wonderment around every corner. Isn't this lovely? It's just like walking through an old village. Yes. Isn't it beautiful? Yes. It is amazing. These little cottages are not here the uh, rest of the year. Oh. They are coming up only for Halloween and Christmas. And what's that there? Is that a hotel? This is a hotel. All this is very nice, but you know me. I want to know what there is to eat and drink here. So what are we having here? Can we have apple skewer with Gluck, please? So this is mulled wine, and what do you call it? It's Gluck. What's floating in there? It's we... a garlic? <laughs> no, it's served with raisins and almonds. Wow. Yeah. Oh, that's beautiful. It's very, very sweet. So it's got a lot of sugar in it. And yeah. you, you get the little bit of sharpness of red wine. It's a very nice drink. It's mulled wine, that's what it is. Yes. But you, what is this? Mate, what is that? This is an apple skewer, what you can get only in Christmas time in Denmark. It's oh, like yeah. a fluffy pancake, and it's sweet, and you eat with jam. And in old times, they actually used to have apple pieces in. That's why it's called apple skewer, which means apple slices. That's really soft and bouncy, look. That's like the texture of a Chinese prawn ball <laughs> without the prawn. That's the texture. And then you dip that in jam. Yeah. Guys, you <laughs> love your sugar, don't you? Oh, yes. Well, you'll need that sugar high because at nearly 8.3 square kilometres, the scale of this place is extraordinary. You've made a whole Christmas village. That's yes. what you've done. Yes. You could just spend all day in here. You can, and uh, if you don't like to do rides, you can just spend hours here to walk around, enjoy the cafes, restaurants, drinks, theater, concerts. Just a wonderful, wonderful Christmas experience. Tivoli really does get you in a Christmassy mood. And when you're ready to venture out around this beautiful city, 